It's raining. I managed to get the marquee up. I'm trying to make a bedroom over top of the tent that is currently the bedroom. Five days of rain, mushrooms coming. Bring you baby. Um, I'm just making this mental note to myself about the talented Mr. Ripley. I always really liked that movie. I think Matt Damon's a bit of a dickhead, but I don't mind him in some movies. I like the Bourne movies. <laughs> Very appropriate now, I must say. Um, but the talented Mr. Ripley, I watched that a few times, and then again, you know, years later and stuff. Um, but yeah, kind of associating now. Um really associating now I'm remembering the movie and he's always trying to um, impress people and get in with them and it's um, it's a chilling movie but it's good but um, yeah yeah my thing is now that I am aware of what I'm like what I do or my lack of emotion or something. It's very different now when I interact with people. Uh, Cause I appear to me and everyone else to be me. Right? Very similar to the old me. Um, depending on the day, but you know, very similar. To the old person I used to be, but completely opposite mindset. So it makes everything very different now when you're interacting with people from um, a point of view where you actually know that you don't give a shit. I gave a guy a lift again today, and um, yeah. By the time I dropped him off, like, uh, two minutes down the road, I was over it. But then, I was over it. So, I just, um, it's different now. So, yeah, um, Anyway, The Talented Mr. Ripley, if you haven't seen that movie, you might as well go watch it. It's just more shit to ingest, but it's um, very appropriate now. I can see why I liked that movie so much and um, it makes a lot of sense. I'm not going to watch it again because I don't watch movies anymore. But yeah, I can remember enough about it to know that, yeah. anyway, that's a thing. I need to ask my shrink. I think I need 20 shrinks, maybe 50.